There we are. Beautiful tree. So let's go over here. Wow. Boom. Ah, there we are. Righty. Let's grab this. Let's do a quick run and jump. Nice. Quest updated. Awesome. We're getting there, guys. We're definitely getting there. We're definitely doing it. What's down there? Uh, we got to go across here. Or let's get this first before we go anywhere. Ever since the Pathfinder program decided to use the Dead Eye Crane blocks as part of their training, my engineers have constantly putting themselves in harm's way to set them up. One poor fellow tragically fell to his death. Um, we don't even wear a damn leaf suit, otherwise he may have lived. What a waste. So only a few really experienced people get to use the leaf suit then on taking it. Oh. 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 Um... I'm guessing I've got to now power that back up. Okay. Soma loading bay. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nice. Here we are then. Let's have a quick look around and. Oh my. That is so beautiful. Oh my. Don't know why that's so pretty to me. Everything's pretty to me in this damn game. Oop. find a training area continue your journey to the, reach the mountaintop facility well let's go So, although I'm gonna really quickly turn down the music just a tiny bit, just so when they talk, I can hear it a slight bit more. Whoa! Oh! Beautiful. Good work. Let's get this over here. Let's get whatever's in you. Okay. Oh, cool. So there was like a facility over here or something, right? Nice. Everyone here thinks I'm a liar. No one believes I got attacked by a grizzly deer one time during my runs. Lucky I managed to extract its life for a good swipe in my face. Got real far before turning back into life energy. I hope I never see the likes of him again. So somewhere out here then. There could be a grizzly bear. Uh, just landed it. Nice. Sweet. Open these up. 
A lot of reading in this game, a lot of reading. No from Pathfinder, the medallions are getting cleaned up fast, getting into that pyramid first is gonna to be tough. Hopefully I find some more quick. I want to be the first explorer. Who knows guys, maybe we'll be the first. Who knows? Who knows? Let's see how far we get with this. Let's grab some of... Oh no, these aren't boxes, damn it. That is though. <laughs> Not too far, I don't go off the edge. I've got so many medallions. I think it's ten, right? I've got nine. I'm only one medallion off. There's a car up here, really? Nice car and all, but a bit far up in it. Oh, that. Why does it seem so damn eerie up here, man? It's scary. I feel like someone's up here, you know, like watching. Continue the journey to the top of the mountain. Quest updated. Find a way inside the facility. How long has this been abandoned? See, I don't think it is. Where did everyone go? I don't think it's abandoned, personally. Uh, let's have a look around. Sorry, I need to read that out loud. <laughs> um, note from work and the colossi statues over there in the valley are a bit unnerving. Why are they over the ancient people who have lived here? Build that kind of scarf. As scary as they are, I still find beauty in them. Something about this monster face is sitting there in a calm forest is an odd sense of allure. Where are they? Well, maybe, just maybe, there's a way in this way. No, nothing up here as of yet. I don't want to jump anywhere because I'll die otherwise. Or I might die anyway. Um, let's think here. I don't want to go anywhere without sort of being clever about it at least. Um, could we land on there maybe? Given the right sort of momentum and stuff, maybe. Uh, ah, just missed it. No, I don't know if we can or not. Um, what's up here? Anything? No. Uh, anything to the right side, maybe. Let's have a look to the right side. Maybe that's where I'm supposed to go the whole time. Ah, uh, yeah, looks like that was the way I was supposed to go the whole time. I have ten medallions. Oh! Nice. Find a way inside the facility? Well... I'm guessing it's where the elevator shaft is, so let's keep going. Last one, blimey. Whoa, and you. So you take four ones to kill, do you? Right, or not kill, I mean revive even. That's what I meant. I'm really sorry, that's really what I meant, I promise. Um Let's Okay, it's gonna take a little bit longer to do, isn't it? Uh oh okay. Uh how can I do this then?
Hold on, hold on to it. And. Are you kidding me? And then let's do a dive. Three, two, one. Ah, perfect. So we're in the little facility now. That's cool. Uh, the life sea found within the valley produced one of every thousand years from the so-called titan tree has been confiscated by the military and taken to the soma facility for scientific purposes now we're trying to find that life seed and grab it so that we can obviously harness the power of life and destroy the moon what, what else would we be doing quest update explore the facility in search of the life seed well let's take some energy from you i hate to steal energy but i feel like we might need it no trees or orbs take energy from the storage cells Why, thank you. Oh, okay, so someone. Okay. Uh, it's kind of eerie, though, really, isn't it? It's kind of eerie. Um, within the same facility, we're surrounded by elements of fuel slug extracted from the valley. As such, we tend to be isolated from the effects of Pathfinder's quantum death side effects. I was amazed one day to at the facility to see saws of dead trees around me. I mean, it's uh, quite the bloody um thing for it, isn't it? Alright, so hold on. What's this then? Alright, so hold on. I've taken all this stuff. Then, we're, then what do we do? I guess we've got to go across here, maybe? Just turning on the lights, I guess. This is um, quite the weird looking area, really. Uh, let's get in here, though. Quite eerie, if I'm honest. So this really is a secretive place. This is kind of scary, but kind of cool at the same time. Okay, let's have a quick look around then. What the hell? Oh, okay, so it's outside. I thought there was something else that I was scared. Hmm. Let's have a quick look. Oh no, I missed. Due to the power strain, the reactor ramps as production meets off in close quota. Eh, frequent power outages, such a wooden wreath generator's backup power. So let's just take some of that it's for the journey. In case I need it, etc. etc. Oh, there's a thing over there. 
You better finish up our project soon. The supply drops are scheduled to arrive in a few more months. Otherwise, due to the isolation policy we're on our own, the pilot knows nothing of this operation other than the orders to drop off supplies and location at the end of this year. I think we told him for the time we told this is for mining operation. No wonder fish is going mad over timeline. Timelines, time fly. I read that wrong, probably. Either way, let's keep going. Got like 12 medallions now. I've ordered a patrol to the same facility again. I've circled through the same room 30, time, 30 times since noon. At least I got a smile at the cute scientist in the precision in the presser chamber each time. He doesn't smile back at me yet. <laughs> well, that's a bit worrying. Smiling at someone, they're not smiling back. It's a bit, a bit shit. God, I'm reading so much, man. By the way, guys, I would like to point out it's currently in what's the time? It's 2 a.m. I am dying. I can't read all this. It's odd to think about what exactly life is once you've experienced quantum death. What exactly are the ingredients that make up my life? Which ingredients aren't really any different than anyone else's? Carbon, calcium, hydrogen, etc. Held together with some energy. So what exactly makes me, me? I guess, if anything, I'm just a pattern. One that forms out of the chaotic blender of the matter of the universe. Like a whirlpool out of water. And then I die. When I die, that pattern simply dissipates back into the cosmos. Are you all the same universe simply expressing itself? Now that's... That is too much for my brain this, at this very minute. <laughs> What's this then? Oh, I took the life force from that. I didn't mean to, but I did. Whoops. Whoa. Flight, whoa. There you go. Let's keep it going. I don't want there to be any um, hostility in this room. Thank you very much, boys. What's this? Please refrain from wasting off his supplies. Uh, note from the boil maker. We're told as a building some sort of alternative to else. My uh, tradesmen are only allowed in certain areas at certain times for certain jobs. They're keeping us completely in the dark, having us. Focus on a single task at a time rather than give us any hints to the big picture while they're hiding from us. Ah, so maybe these guys are in the dark as well. So this really is like a secret operation kind of thing. Like no one knows, no one's supposed to know, no one's gonna know. It's really sort of um out of nowhere dark kind of thing. Where are we supposed to be heading then? Is it up here? So I thought that's when we came in, unless we came in over here. We did. Okay, it's this way. So that's him finding sort of the quantum reality. I'm gonna need to take some of that life force, I'm really sorry. I hate to do that, but I'm gonna need to until I got um some stuff back. Then I'll, I'll, I'll make some stuff all pretty and nice again. I promise. Welcome to the Pathfinder program. I've already seen all this. Ugh. Let's keep going. 